Hey guys, I'm back with another YouTube video. I got a good text there and I have asked me this. You know when uh, people say like, oh, it's sexist to talk about housewives and all. Why is that? Now, can you go through everything, please? Yep. Problem. So, you know when they say, hey, it's actually quite bad though that, did you know, that everyone may, may do know or do know, is that when you actually say, oh, housewife housewives everywhere like that yeah it's kind of like sexist i mean yeah it's kind of like a black thing nearly really mm-hmm yeah that's what it is to be fair black lives matter housewives matter basically Ugh. really mm -hmm. and then it's kind of like you know when you say right uh wife my, she's my girlfriend now she's working all the time there now and then we're married now so she turns into a housewife basically equals she has to clean up everything in the house and everything like that mind the kids do the homework they're clean up messes clean up spills change the own nappies you know they're big sloppy ones yuck they're like that you know yeah and then these rude people come in unannounced to them you could be their next door neighbor could be whatever and say how are the housewives today or even in the bar or a pub how are the housewives today you say that to them oh my god yeah they're literally gonna literally shoot you if they had a gun with them really yep they would they'll actually set the husband after you what yep why because it's a sexist thing it's like the black thing you slagged off a black person it's like hey do you know when it's night time right yeah i couldn't see you you know what i mean so it's like oh who said that who said that you know what i mean as it's like exact same thing when it comes to slagging off housewives literally like, if you think about it, right, you should actually be grateful that she's doing all the ironing, money the kids for you there. Because if you think about it, if you have um, kids there on your own, yeah, who's going to mind the kids? Hmm? Um, no one. Exactly. Because someone has to bring in the money. And it has to be mm, the man with the money. Mm-hmm. Yep. Basically, <sighs> like that, you know, and that's the th that's the thing. So, Keen, if we actually say to women that there are girlfriends and all, and, and they're working now and all, but when we're married and all, and have a family, is it going to be different? Absolutely. The women are going to say, "No, I don't want to work for money." That's your job. My job is mind the kids and keep up with the household stuff. There like that. And then if you slag them off about loads of things, you know, or it's like, ah, she's just a housewife or something like that. There, it's wrong. Rings wrong. Wrong answer altogether. Really? Yep, yeah, she cooks, cleans the dinner for you. Imagine if you have to do all that activity and during the weekend saturday and sunday when you are actually off of work working for the cash of income oh shit so you'd be working seven days a week basically uh, for fuck's sake yeah so i don't think you should be slagging off the wife to there about anything to be fair with you you shouldn't be slagging them off about like ah. Uh, I don't know why my wife went to college for, like, when she's, she's set for life there. Oh, wrong answer altogether, dude. Shouldn't be saying that. Why? Tell them, Keen. Because all she has to do is say, hey, wait a second. There's no prenup or anything. I'm divorcing you. Oh, and then you still have to pay for the wife then anyway, when she's not with you. Oh, for fuck's sake. Alimony and yep. Ugh. So you're still technically by law, you're still actually paying for the woman when when she's not even living with you. 
there. Basically, yeah. <sighs> I don't like this. Nope. No one does. Oh, this is this is mean. It is mean. That's why you should never slag off our being sexist to a woman. Never be. Never be one. Never slang off the sexist ones at all. Because if you do, yeah. Divorce. Yeah. Goodbye, husband. I'll take half your money. Oh, for fuck's sake. Like that, you know what I mean? Or put up the house for sale there like that. I get half of it. I think you could live in, in an apartment block somewhere. You know what I mean? It's just like, oh, really? And you, you wouldn't be happy with yourself whatsoever. You ruined it. That's why you should never slag off your own wife at all. It's fine when you're slagging with the with the lads and slag off your girlfriends there or your wives because they won't be hearing you. True, true. You know what I mean? That is true. It is fucking true. You know? So that's why you should always keep your sexist activities to yourself. The slagging, the slagging men out there that slag off them and say, like, don't have to work a day in my life. There, I wish I, I was a house husband there. Don't have to work a day in my life. There, everything handed to me. There, like that. I wish I was a housewife. Oh my God. I'll be set for life. But who's actually paying? Oh yeah, that's right. Exactly. But the wives can get away with it. Is the thing. There. But you know, how come there's like, every single woman that, I mean like, the parents tell all the women to actually, like uh, work, go to college, get qualified and all and then once they're married then they act like that then. So what's the point in going to college? Well it's to do with this, yeah? Not every woman is actually married. Oh and what happens though if the husband makes low income? Oh shit. They'll find a way to actually Pay it up, pay the money up in full, like that. Oh, right, I get you. And then if their parents are alive, yeah, they'll just throw the kids into, into there, into the, into their parents' house there, like that. That are in their eighties or nineties, there like that. They work nine to five and be done with it, make loads of money, like that. No, oh, she drives a nice Range Rover. So does my husband. We make loads of money. We're milking the cash. There, like that. Really? Mm-hmm. There's some people actually have loads of fucking money. Like that. Really? Yes. And that's why women go to college, men. That's why. Really? Yep. So they're not uh, actually, like, gold diggers really at all. No, if you can make a good enough living... Yeah. They'll be housewives then. Basically, yes. Wow. That's mad. Because she knows then you're going to be able to cover all the costs of being a wife. Minding the kids. There like that. You know what I mean? Because if you don't mind the kids at all, where does it go to? Old oh, child services. Where are you? They'll just take your kids away. Oh, so it's kind of like duty of care also. Ah, for fuck's sake. So you're basically in a cage, boys. Once it comes to marriage, it's a very fucking serious thing. Very serious. What do you think women say on movies or TV shows and they say, Are you sure? Are you sure? Yes, I'm fucking sure. I'm, I have the ring right here. And the reason why she says, are you sure? Are you sure? Is because she knows that. You know, when you make that much, are you sure you, you, are you, sure you want to do this? Oh. Um, hmm. That's kind of weird because, like, she's in love with him. Yeah, but maybe because, like, he wants a family. She's like... Yeah, we're like two kids, you know what I mean? You can't just leave one, so obviously it's going to be two kids. Because if it's only one kid, then what are they going to play with then? On their own? Or play with the walls? True, true. You know what I mean? It's a lot of money, husband. Are you sure? Are you sure? Are you sure? 
eagles. Wow. So true. There. Pequino. Is it true that like. Like. um, When we slide. When men slide off the husbands. Oh, I mean like of the housewives. Yeah. What do they say though? Like. Oh. They'd be saying the rudest things ever. They'd be like. I wish I was a house husband. Don't have to do anything. I just have to cook and clean and mind the place. That's sexist. You know what I mean? Men would be thinking that's like, I wish I, wish I had every single day off. Oh, it'd be great. You know what I mean? Then there's other ones out there would be like sexist as in like talking about it to other people and the the other people out there. Yeah, we'll be saying, this guy here is upset. <sighs> Obsessed with sexist women. Mother of God. Really? Oh, stop. He came by the other day, past me house and all. And he was talking to this fella there. I had my back door window open. And uh, I can hear him. He's a very loud person, actually. And uh, he was saying this. You know when, when there's so many housewives everywhere... All the time, right? And they cook and clean that. But, like, where's the income coming from? The husband, like, it's unbelievable there. And also, as well, when they're actually saying, it's actually, isn't this awful weird, though, right? Wait, before you go, before you go to mind the kids again, excuse me? No, 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 just wait a second. What, what, what? What then? Go on, carry on. Is that there's so many women out there that say, "Oh, it's actually sexist to actually uh, to ask your wife to work, your wife to work for a living." It's actually sexist, but it's not sexist to actually. I mean, just to leave her at home. Yeah, basically, yeah, yeah. Well, you're not wrong actually, but don't, but don't tell anyone that now. I won't, I won't, but you're, you are right though, you are right, yep, yep, absolutely, it's actually sexist to actually tell the woman, y y your wife, to actually go and fucking work there, when she, but like, who's, who's gonna mind the kids, you know what I mean, so if it's the other way around, it's like, if you leave your, if the housewife becomes your wife, yeah, it's like, you're not a sexist man at all. You're not a sexist man at all then, if you leave the wife at home. Oh, so is that she sexist? Does she let the wife work, basically? In short terms, yes. That's what it is, really. Oh my god. So I, so I was right after all. Basically, yeah.